are the last, the grand finale of the Karsty reunion. We're in Stillwater. We're going to have dinner on the boat with a little program. I think the first ones here is John and Connie and their kids. Lenore Howard. Chris. Sean Adams, Kathy, one of these boats back here is where we're going to go on. Have a good summer. Oh. Have a good summer. Here we have Andy. Oh, and here's the two love birds. Kansas City kids. Bob and Cindy? Love your hat, Carla. Look at that dress. She's got pantaloons on. Here we have Carla 
patiently waiting. She's got the name, but she just doesn't have the last cup of coffee. Here we have father daughter serious discussion. Isabelotas, Lois, and Chris. And here's Tom. Who else is coming here? Which one's ours? Everybody know? Oh, well, here comes Bob. You didn't bring my sweatshirt, did you? That one is not And Cindy. Well, hi there, Eric. Who else is coming here? Oh, here's Julie. <laughs> Good shot. <laughs> We're boarding the boat. Uh, I don't know. Which one we're going on? Come some more or go some more. Chris, stop it. Don't, don't crowd like that because you're making a doctor. Uh, Wanna go single file? Find out, man. Doctor's all that way to you. Ah, we're told to go single file. Hey, Chris. Yes. Chris? Yes. Chris? Yes. Save some seats so we can have cake. Night. You gotta talk to me though. Can you talk? Bon voyage. Well, I tell you what. There's not much we can do when yeah. they're done or, you know, yeah. Yeah. Well, told Al, don't for, go back and get well, the cake. I hope he didn't. Watching this place at quarter to six. Oh, yeah. gosh. And I, if we knew where, I could have snuck onto the shoulder and, uh -huh. and drove down. But, I, but you're fine now. All better. You are here. <sighs> here we have... Elaine and Dick leisurely riding, and Brandon and Sherry. <laughs> so that's their watching, sailing down St. Croix. And here we have Becky. And Chris. Up there. I don't know. Huh? You let people come, people are coming behind you, so you gotta come down. Okay? Thank you.
And here comes Eric with his wonderful boots. And here we have a little group. What? We know the last game that they played, they were 29 to 6. They lost. On the top deck. I called y'all. He called and said, hey, I'm just taking a bath. Oh, geez, I thought we got rid of you. Quit picking your nose, Chris. Here's our reunion. <laughs> 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 Betsy's pretending not to notice. I want a man. <laughs> so he, he doesn't think much of it, so he goes back to his room and, and he goes back to bed. The next night, the same thing happens. He hears something in his mother's room. He goes, looks in the door, and there she is. I want a man. <laughs> I want a man. <laughs> well, so he goes back to his room. He's getting a little tired of this, so he, he goes back, goes back to bed. The next night, he hears something a little bit differently, so he goes into the room. Here's in there, and there's his mother with the with the man hugging and kissing him and you know, doing all that. <laughs> so what he does, he goes back to his room, and then about five minutes later, his mother starts hearing something in in the little boy's room. So she walks down the hallway, looks in his in his, uh, in his room, and there he is. I need a bison. <laughs> How about here? Who's the youngest one here tonight? Well, Eric. Is Eric the youngest child here tonight? No? Andy. Andy? Oh, hey. How old is he? Just three? Stand up, Andy. Yeah. Andy, stand up. Andy, you have to stand up. You're the youngest person here. Yay. Yay.
with a cursed it, Ruby? It's up here. Oh, oh is that the skull <laughs>
arms didn't go down, the wind, lights didn't go on, the, change, or the train just came right through. I was railroaded. <laughs> well, thank you very much. I'm deeply honored and uh, I don't know what else to say. Uh, <laughs>
You say that all the time, but then you come through. Jane's just had a couple drinks and she's being a little maudlin, so don't take any of it. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I don't know who that was. I don't either. Well, let me see. It was some sort of imposter. Oh, girl. I know. That's the. Who, who are you at the Renaissance? You can snot. Oh, no, you're not. This is Joel. It couldn't have gone to a better person. We think so. Most deserving, yeah. Most deserving. Not well, sure why. We already know what we're going to do with it. The Unfortunately, the pickings were slim. Yeah. Do it like I think you should have it singed and burned on your chest right here. Oh, so it will put that fire up. Now you got to put it at, you got to you got to put that up at your work. Yeah. Am I supposed to what are you going to do now? Profound? Yes. I'm going to um, live a good life. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, if, you, if you hadn't laughed, I would have believed you. <laughs> I got to go to bed. I got a show tomorrow. Okay. <laughs> Chris's.